Hello welcome back to another video. In this video we are going to be counting down the top 5 ranger weapons for the time you get them. I made this list by comparing them to bosses and enemies at around the time you get them. This has a base damage of 31 but is insanely fast. It has around a 5.55% to 12.5% chance of dropping from San to MK1 during the frost boom. It is very inaccurate so I recommend using chlorophyte bullets because they home in on enemies. In my opinion it is one of the best weapons for fighting the pillars for the first time. This has a base damage of 24 and can be crafted with 10 hell stone bars and a handgun at a lead or iron anvil. Handguns are found in chests in the dungeon after Skeletron has been defeated. It isn't auto fire but it can still fire pretty fast. It is insane against the wall of flesh and some early hard mode enemies. This has a base damage of 60 but it fires 5 arrows and only uses up 1. It has a 20% drop chance from Jube Fishrom. It is also insane against the pillars and is almost as good as the Phantasm. It is also pretty good for farming Duke Fishron and in my opinion is one of his best drops. This has a base damage of 43 but rains arrows down from the sky. If you combine it with holy arrows it make fighting the destroyer a walk in the park. It has a 25% drop chance from hallowed mimics. The only downside about this is that you need a massive space to use it underground and it is very inaccurate. It has a base damage of 25 and is crafted with mini shark. Illegal gun parts. 5 shark fins. And 20 souls of might. I used this weapon so much and without it I think I would still be stuck on the twins. It can even be used up until plantera. 